Is it right to pray for wealth and prosperity? Although the Bible is very clear in 1 Timothy 6 verse 10, for the love of money is the root of all kind of evil, for which some have strayed from the faith in their greediness and pierced themselves through with many sorrows. It is also clear from Ecclesiastes 5 verse 19 that wealth and riches are a gift from God. In Ecclesiastes 5 verse 19, the Bible says, Moreover, when God gives someone wealth and possessions and the ability to enjoy them, to accept their lot and be happy in their toil, this is a gift of God. It is God's desire to see His children move in great authority through building and distributing wealth. From start to finish, the Bible is filled with many wonderful promises of God. More than that, every situation that we ever face and will ever encounter in our lives, there's an answer, a solution, or a strategy by which we can overcome. Today we are going to declare God's promises of victory for financial miracles. Believe on the Lord Jesus and watch God's words come to life in your situation. Dealing with financial difficulties can leave you feeling tired and stressed out. These powerful prayers for financial miracles and financial help from God will encourage you in your faith and walk with Jesus Christ. Tonight let's worship and praise God and pray for powerful financial blessings to come upon our lives. Let's begin. Creator God, I praise you because you made the heavens, even the highest heavens, and all the story hosts, the earth and all that is on it, the seas and all that is in them. You give life to everything, and the multitudes of heaven worship you. God, I praise you because you are the Lord, and there is no other apart from you. There is no other God. Father, I praise you because you are the Lord who heals me. Praise be to the Lord, to God, my Savior, who daily bears my burdens. I praise and honor you, Father, because you are God who loves to answer prayer and who begins to answer before I pray. I praise you, Father, because you have ever forsaken me, for you are gracious and merciful God. I praise you for being the only God, our Savior, the glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and forever. I praise you because you are a loving God and your nature is that of love. Lord, I thank you for being a just God and my justifier because I believe in Jesus Christ. I give you praise, O Lord, because you have granted me eternal blessings and made me glad about the joy of your presence. I will praise you because you are my help and my deliverer, O Lord. I praise you, Lord, because you are my light and my salvation, and because you know what lies in darkness, and light dwells in you. Father, I praise you because you are the God of my peace, who will soon crush Satan under my feet. Praise be to God, our Lord, who still do wonders and miracles on the earth today and display His power among the people. I praise you, Lord, who makes all grace abound in me and generously provides all I need. Praise to you, my God, because you always protect me, my victory who always leads me in triumph, possession in Christ. Thank you, Father. I praise your name because of your great and abundant of stability and faithfulness in my life, for they are new every morning. I want to bless you with praise, Father, because you are a forgiving God gracious and compassionate, slow to anger, and abounding in love. My shepherd, my Lord, who will shepherd me and guide me in the paths of righteousness for your name's sake. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of compassion, and the God of all comfort. I praise and adore you, Lord, as the Holy One of Israel, my Redeemer, the God of all the earth. Father, you are only my rock and my salvation. You are my refuge and fortress. I shall not be moved. My refuge is in you. I just want to praise you, Father, for your grace, your unearned and undeserved favor, that I might reign also through righteousness, which issues in internal life through Jesus. Father God, I praise you because you are a shield around me, O Lord. You bestow glory on me and lift up my head when I am weary or despised. Father, I give praise, glory, and honor to you for being generous, God, who did not even stop short of giving your own son, Jesus, for me. I praise you, Lord, for being my deliverance and salvation and for setting me free from death. I thank you, Lord, that I can learn more about my greatness, for you are great. I want to get to know you better and draw closer to you. I give praise to you, Lord, because you are not slow in your promises toward your children, but in long suffering. You are waiting patiently for everyone to come to repentance. Thank you for your patience with me, Lord. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, I thank and praise you for your marvelous wonders. I thank you for this brand new day of prayer and praises. 
I will bless your name at all times, and my lips will speak of your works. I will praise you, Lord, for this is where my help and strength come from, with situation or circumstances that comes against me. I will praise and worship the Lord my God and go through these storms of life surrounded by my angels, who are messengers sent forth to protect me. I thank you, Lord, that I am covered by the blood of Jesus Christ, and no weapon that is formed against me will prosper. My praise to you will continue to be in my mouth when I wake up in the morning, do my daily routines, and before I fall asleep at night. I will do this continuous praise as long as there is breath in my body, I will praise you. In the name of Jesus Christ, I bind Satan, the ruler spirit, every principality, every power, ruler of darkness, wicked spirit in high places, the spirits of poverty and python, and all their underlying and territorial spirits, all above, around, and below them, and all spirits not of the Holy Spirit manifesting against my finances. I lose myself in finances from their wicked and demonic grip. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command Satan to release your grip from my financings, along with all those evil spirits and all spirits not of the Holy Spirit. I command you to get your hands off my finances, my income, and my possession this day and every day to come in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, I break every spirit of poverty and financial lack that was inherited through my bloodline. I wipe it off my life by the blood of Jesus. I ban all family and generational curses of poverty and break every satanic chain of poverty of my life in the name of Jesus. I renounce and reverse every financial curse through the blood of eternal covenant in the name of Jesus. I bound and destroy the activities of anti-harvest forces in the name of Jesus. All spiritual padlock that lack out my wealth from coming into my life, melt to ashes right now in the name of Jesus. Every device of the enemy to divert my wealth through sickness, sudden death, accident, and financial emergency be destroyed by the fire of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command Satan to restore sevenfold, return all you have stolen from me. For the word says, when a thief is found, he must return all he has stolen sevenfold. Lord, I know your word is true and will not return to you void. Every mark or handwriting of poverty and material lack on my life be wiped off by the blood of Jesus. I pull down every financial roadblock in the name of Jesus. I command all crooked places to be made straight in the name of Jesus. I command all financial miracles to arrive by speed in the name of Jesus. I command all financial desert and wilderness to be turned into springs and pools of flowing living water in the name of Jesus. I bind every spirit of unfruitfulness in my life, and I command my barren grounds to be healed and restored in the name of Jesus and by the blood of Jesus. By my trusting faith in Jesus Christ, I call my finances restored, prosperous, and full of God's abundance according to the Lord Jesus Christ's plan for my life. I am blessed because I walk not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor stand with sinners, nor do I sit with the scornful. I choose to spend my days delighting in the law of the Lord and meditating in His words day and night. And because of this, I am like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bring forth fruit in my season. And what I do will not wither, and whatsoever I do shall prosper. Thank you, Lord, for the miraculous supplies of every need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. I praise you and glorify your holy name for all that you have done and what you are doing in my life. I receive by faith in Jesus Christ the full restoration of my financial position right now. My Father in heaven, it is you who gives me power to get wealth, that your covenant is established in earth and in my life in the name of Jesus. I break and annul all assignment of the enemy against my finances in Jesus' name. I break and annul all curses of poverty, lack, debt, and failure in the name of Jesus. I seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all things are added to me. I rebuke and cast all spirit of the cankerworm, the palmer worm, the caterpillar, and locust that will eat up my blessings in Jesus' name. Dear Lord, I send this prayer for immediate financial blessing in the hope that you hear my prayer and understand the urgency of this special request. You ask us to turn to you in our need, and you will listen and help us. I know that you are all goodness and wisdom, Lord, and you can see what a difference the financial blessing will have on my life right now. I am in urgent need of support and grace in these tough times. The single thing that will make a difference to my life right now is financial blessing. I have a real and urgent need to have some help financially. I know, Lord, that you are always there for me in times of trouble. You have helped me so often in my life. I thank you for everything that you have done for me, Lord. 
There may be times when I have felt to thank you in the past. Lord, when you have helped me, and I may not have noticed your intervention. I thank you now for all that support that you have given me and know that I can never repay your goodness and your love. This is the time when I need you most. I am struggling in every way and I need help and I have nowhere else to turn. You are always there for me when I need you most and I know I can rely on your help and intervention. You are my bounty for God and I know you want me to be successful and happy in life. There are times when things happen and you know that it is out of my control, Lord. These are the darkest of time and the times I need you the most, dear Jesus. Please grace me with your kindness and your mercy and help me find financial blessings now in my life. You are the only one who can help me now in my hour of need. You are an all-powerful Lord and you can see exactly what is happening in my life and the need I have for your support right now. I know I have asked you for help in the past and I am coming to you again. And I know you have infinite patience with your flock. You see my weaknesses and yet you still love me and care for me, Lord. Lord, I try in every way in my life as you command. Sometimes the way you have set me is difficult and I do not always succeed. I also know that you do not send me burdens I cannot bear. I know I work with your love in my heart. I know you carry me at times, Lord, when my burdens are too great. Help me now, Lord. Find a way to send me a financial blessing. Help me to see a way to bring this into my life right now, to manifest the money I need to get through this period. You know, Lord, that I try my best to provide for all my needs, but it is difficult for me to make ends meet at times. And there are too many things that I need to look after. I carry a lot of responsibility. Right now, I am in some trouble. And I know that if you hear this prayer for financial blessings, that you will see my need and my righteous plea for your help. You never leave me or forsaken me, Lord. You never abandon your faithful servant. I ask that you help me now to find a way to manifest what I need in my life right now. I trust you, Lord. You have never let me down before. You are always so gracious in your care for me and so full of love for me that I am blown away by the amount of love you have for your people here on earth. You can see my suffering, the way this current situation is affecting my life and my health, and you give us the strength to get through it. You always walk by our sides and help us to survive everything thrown at us. On this occasion, my greatest need is not just the strength to get through this situation, but I need the practical means to do so. You know what I really need right now is financial blessing, a way of bringing enough money into my life quickly to be able to pay off anything I owe and set me on the right path for the future. Lord, I know you understand suffering and you do not wish to see your true followers suffer. You can see how difficult things are for me, and I know you have lots of ways of helping me. This prayer for a financial blessing isn't just for me, Lord. It is to help me take care of any responsibilities I have so that I'm in position to help others in needs. I always try to follow your commands, Lord, to put others first, to walk in your love, and to help others where I can. If there is a way that I can help right now, please make this happen for me so that I'm in a better position to walk forward in your path, Lord. I give you thanks and praise for all your help, and I know your divine power, a miracle will happen in my life, and you will usher forth abundance, and all will be well. I know I am asking for your grace and bounty, and that when this miracle is granted to me, I will be forever in your debt, Lord. I praise you for the love you have shown me and your presence in my life. It helps me to know that you are there for me, Lord, and I can trust you to look after me and provide me with the help I need. Thank you for your love and presence in my life. In the mighty name of my Lord Jesus Christ, amen.